OGs, it is a new day, and if you guys read by the title, your girl is going on a date night. I'm going on a date today, and before we even get started into this video, I want to give a big, big, big thank you to Estee Lauder for sponsoring this video. Now, let me put y'all down so I can read y'all to do list because it's really not a to-do list, y'all. I mean, y'all already seen the title. Your girl is getting ready, and y'all are getting ready with me while I get ready for date night, and y'all gonna come with me to date night. So, pretty much the day, my day went like... Yeah, I've been sleeping. I've had a long, long last past few weeks. So I've just been like sleeping in and just sleeping and just getting rest because you girl just needed to rest up and just come back to life. So today, well last night I got my hair done as y'all can see. Y'all see the braids, y'all see the braids. Y'all see the braids, baby. Get into the details, baby. Y'all see it, y'all see it right. Oh God damn. And I also got my lashes done this morning. As y'all can see, it's probably my eyes kind of red, but I got a fresh lash set. I've been wearing makeup a ton, so she took all my lashes off and gave me a whole fresh new set because my old lashes were like filled with makeup. So I am going to be getting dressed. I need to pick up my outfit, y'all, for date night. I don't know what I want to wear, but we're going to get to that. And I'm going to do my makeup, and we're going to do like a little chit chat and while I do my makeup. So that's pretty much the gist of today's video. I literally cleaned my entire house <laughs> this morning because it was a mess like y'all i literally cleaned it up the trash bag gotta go to the trash but i literally cleaned my whole house because it was so junk first things first we're about to figure out what your girl is going to be wearing today well later today tonight so we are in the closet so that we can pick out the outfit and y'all said y'all loved me um y'all love when i pick out my outfit so i'm gonna continue to do that and since it is date night, y'all gonna help me pick out, well, not help me, but y'all gonna see me pick out what I'm gonna wear tonight, which honestly, I have no clue. I kinda got an idea. I think I want to wear black, like all black, but we we'll see where my mind goes with that because right now I have no clue. I'm literally standing in my closet with a blank because I don't know. By the way, I'm drinking out of my cup. Y'all already know, CELD, boom. I'm drinking water, by the way, y'all. Hydrating up. But, whew, let's see, let's see, let's see. I kind of have a little idea. Wait, 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 wait. I'm debating on wearing this dress, which has no sleeves. It's mesh. I believe it's a little see-through. Like, can y'all tell? But I'm thinking about wearing this. It has a little slit right here. It's not too high, which, honestly, I wish it was higher. So maybe I should cut it to make it higher. But I'm thinking about this dress with some boots i'm also trying to figure out if i want to wear gold or silver jewelry but if i wear this dress then nine times out of ten the jewelry would probably be silver so hmm all right y'all so i have two options i'm thinking it's gonna be between this dress which is sleeveless and i never wore this before this bag it has gold detailing so I'm gonna have to wear gold. These shades, baby, latte. Y'all already know from my line, L-O-R-B-A-E. <laughs> Follow, baby. And it's between this dress I already showed y'all and these shoes. So I'm trying to figure out which one I like better because my hair is in braids. I feel like it can go either way because <laughs> I'm dressing up my braids, which you could dress up braids, but sometimes usually when I wear braids, I'm kind of like rocking tennis shoes and stuff like that. So it's between that this dress with this bag which ooh, this could possibly be a look so i'm gonna bring both of these down and then i'm just lay it out and then i'm gonna figure it out once my makeup is done because you know if you know then once your makeup is complete then the outfit comes together once your hair is done your makeup is done the outfit looks 10 times better already so i'm gonna try both outfits on once my makeup is done so i'm about to go do it makeup all right y'all so i am about to begin my makeup and y'all already know I got to moisturize my lips before I do any freaking thing. Moisturize your lips first. All right, y'all, so I'm about to begin my eyebrows because there's the step that I do first before I start my makeup. And I had you guys ask me some questions so that I can give y'all a little update, a life update, all of it. I mean, I feel like I did so many videos this past month, April. And y'all seen a lot, and a lot happened, like, ugh, jeez. I feel like so much happened in such a short amount of time, and then like when you blink, like it's all just over with. But let's see. Are you doing what you truly want to do? Ugh. 
Yo, let me just say I am definitely doing what I want. And that, and what that means is literally anything I want, I'm doing. Like, I don't care about no opinions. I don't care about like what he say, she say, they say do this, they say do that. And now, at this point in my life, I'm literally doing whatever it is I want to do. Dear, dear, Bichet Taylor. Whatever I want to do, that is what I'm doing. So, yes. I am definitely doing what I truly want to do. Will you break the rules because of something slash someone you care about? Mm, I say yes. A thousand percent. I will definitely break the rules for something or someone. Like, I break the rules. But honestly, I feel like it depends on the rule. Like, what it is that I'm breaking or what it, like, what I gotta sacrifice or what it is necessarily that I'm doing. I feel like it depends. <laughs> so, what is it that you look for in a partner? And y'all, let me tell y'all something. What I look for in a partner is just, Number one, loyalty, that's just literally top of the list. Number two, we're probably just being genuine. Like I just I just want somebody who's genuine. Like that's literally it. Loyal, genuine, and funny. Like top of the list. Like I feel like everything, like anything in the world I can get on my own. Like I can get myself. So so I feel like when it comes to like materials, like honestly, well. I'm gonna be real with y'all too. Like, my love language is gifts, but it's not my only love language. But when it comes to gifts, I feel like my love language when it comes to gifts, it's like, you know, things I like, but it's also like sentimental things. Like, I feel like it's the little things that I love. Like, that literally is like the weight of my heart. So, I feel like somebody who pay attention, who caters to me, caters to my needs, who knows me off the back of the hand, knows what I want, know what I like, know what I don't like. And somebody who just likes me for me. Like, just a down-to-earth person who likes me for me and not for Vieira. Like, you like me because you like me, not because I'm quote-unquote Vieira, if that makes sense. So, that's probably what I will be looking for or what I'm looking for in a partner. That's literally it. That's the main thing. That's it. Like, anything else, I can get myself. I don't need anything. I don't need anything from anybody. <laughs> just love, real love, loyalty and just like being genuine, like, and don't lie. Like, I don't like liars. Like, especially like when it's like small stuff. Like, just keep it real with me up front and we'll be straight, so. That's literally it, what else? Y'all, I forgot to name one thing, well, it's kinda the same thing as like, just be real and up front and not lie, is like trust. Like, I gotta be able to trust you. If I can't trust you, or I feel like I can't trust you, then it's automatically just not. Mm -mm, mm -mm. So it gotta be trust. So that leads for the next question is just pretty much, do you trust people in your life? And I'm gonna be real with y'all. When it comes to trust, especially for me, like I don't really just trust people off the bat. Like I don't really, I gotta, you gotta show me that I can trust you right off the bat. Like I don't just, oh, let my guard down and just decide that I'm just gonna trust somebody a thousand percent and just let somebody in a hundred percent. No, like it don't come that easy. Like you gotta show me beforehand. So, but it is people in my life. Like I trust my family, I trust my friends, like that. But yeah, no, when it comes to relationships and stuff, y'all, I don't trust nobody. <laughs> I don't trust nobody unless you show me that I can trust you. And until then, the trust is not there. <laughs> or I feel like, too, if you give me a reason to not trust you or you, like, sneaky or something, then that's a different story. But honestly, I just feel like, for me, I'm very, like, I'm very, like, I'm very hard on protecting myself and just not letting my guard down. <clears throat> because I would hate to let my guard down and your girl get this point. So, yes. All right, y'all, next I am about to do my foundation. And I have to wear my beauty blender. I don't know if y'all wish yours or not, but I have to wear my beauty, blend beauty blender before I um put my makeup on. Just is dead on me. Brows is completed. So before I put on my foundation, I obviously gotta prime your face, y'all. I'm already moisturizing my face for some reason. I don't know, literally. I don't know why I don't put on primer before I even start my makeup in general, like even before I start my brows, it's just a habit. Like I just always do it after my brows and before my foundation. Whew. Y'all, one thing about me, 
Like when it comes to like, cause I know somebody asked me a while ago, like what was my dream date? <laughs> and honestly y'all, I feel like my dream date is probably some, something somewhere pertaining to food. Like just, I feel like, okay, so I love to eat, but I feel like my definition of a date night is something that I love, which is food. Like I love food, y'all, I love to eat. Like I love to do adventurous things too, but like I really love to eat, I really love to try things. So I feel like my dream date or my best date would probably be like at a restaurant, but like not just any restaurant, a unique restaurant. And because I've seen this before, but it's like different course, different taste, they tasting like you could taste all the food on the menu like that type of place like just not no normal restaurant where you just go or the food on the menu which i love that too but i'm just saying y'all ask for my dream date that would be that flying out of the country somewhere <laughs> that's a date baby <laughs> but i feel like that is probably like my main 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 thing is just eating. like i love to eat so a place that like i can try different things off the menu like a 10 course meal i don't know some is that even a thing? Five course meal, six course meal, ten course meal. A place like that, I would love. So for my foundation, I'm going to be using Focus Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay In Place Makeup, which is the number one foundation in the US. And it also has a matte finish, which I love y'all because I feel like for some reason, if I'm wearing makeup for a long time, it always gets oily like around my T-zone. I already said that before, but that is the reason why I like my um, foundation matte. So y'all, the foundation feels lightweight and it also has 24 hour staying power. So y'all know sometimes y'all wear your makeup for a long time. You can tell that you've been wearing it for a long time. So it is also oil free, sweat and humidity proof and it won't clog your pores and cause breakouts because a lot of foundation y'all, especially if you wear makeup a lot, it tends to clog your pores. And if your pores are clogged, it causes you to break out. Baby, she looking beast of the guys. Okay, girl. Blend, 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 baby. Estee Lauder also has shades for all skin tones and they have available over 55 shades, y'all. And like I said, if you're wondering my skin tone or my shade, it is sandalwood. Can y'all see that? Because a lot of people ask <clears throat> like my shade and foundation. And I am using sandalwood. So make sure you guys shop now and find your perfect shade using the Estee Lauder's virtual trial tool at estelauder.com. So go get y'all foundation, y'all. I don't know how, but I literally forgot contour. <laughs> I was about to blend my freaking concealer without applying my contour. Like I said, y'all, I literally just got my freaking um, eyelashes done, so I'm not trying to get makeup on them. And like I mentioned too before, since I wear lash extensions, I don't usually put on any eyeshadow. So all I do is really foundation, my eyebrows, contour, and lips, and that's it. Y'all, that is one thing I love about this foundation because when I wear makeup, I literally don't like wearing makeup because I hate when I wear makeup and it feel like I'm wearing makeup, if that makes sense. So it is very lightweight. So I literally love it because it doesn't feel like anything is on my face. But I am pretty much, actually, forgot one step. I forgot my eyeliner, bottom liner. So that is pretty much completed. And now it's time for my lips. Brown eyeliner, actually, y'all, because I feel like brown eyeliner is literally like lip liner. Don't be dark enough for me, so I gotta go with like brown eyeliner, like something that's made for eyeliner. Ooh, this girl is looking big. And let me not put my beauty mark because I always have to put on my beauty mark, y'all. I'm trying to look in the camera and then look in the mirror. And I don't want to mess up, so let me look in the mirror. Oh yeah. I am ready, y'all. So all I gotta do is put on my clothes and I am good to go. Let me add a little bit more lip. 
Y'all already know this is literally the same look I do every single time. And every makeup look that I always do. So this is my regular, my huge. But the look is complete. Mmm, mmm. Get into it, baby. Y'all see it. Mm. So I'm about to, I was about to say do my hair, but my hair is already did. But I'm about to do my edges and then put on my clothes. So let's go. As y'all can see, I already have my outfits out. And by the way, now that my makeup is done, I kind of already am leaning towards the black outfit that I picked out. So I'm going to try it on and see how it looks all put together. But now that I've seen it, it's going to be the black look because I feel like it's just uh -oh. so nice with what I have on already. With the makeup, I feel like it's going to be cute. Alright y'all, the edges are done. So now all I have to do is just put on my clothes. Y'all, I can't get over how good my makeup looks like. Ah! Y'all, mm, it looks good. But the fits are laid out y'all. And like I said, this is probably the one I'm leaning towards. And this is the second one. But I think I'm going to be wearing this one right here. So I'm about to put it on, put the look together. Oh yes, y'all. So I feel like this dress was the dress. I'm glad I went with this. Now I'm trying to figure out which necklace. This one or this one, which has hearts on it. Can you see? Mmm, that's a hard choice. I literally don't know. I can't pick. Any, mini money, mo. Catch a piggy by So if you had to let it go, any, mini money, mo. I'm gonna go with this one. All right, y'all, so now for the shoes. I decided on these boots. And y'all, these shoes is so freaking hard to get on by myself. So I literally be struggling, because it won't go down. I have to stand up, and I have long nails on y'all. I don't know if you know this, your girl got a long nails back, but I'm going back to short soon. So now that I, since I have these long nails on, it's so hard to pull, because I don't want to break a nail. this purse which is so little literally nothing to fit so I'm gonna have to end up taking my card out like my ID and stuff and putting it in here by itself because the wallet ain't gonna fit and I'm gonna probably wear it like this so I am all dressed y'all and right now it is about to be four o'clock and dinner reservations is supposed to be at five I believe but this is the fit y'all I end up tying it around like that because I mean, what y'all think? Should I leave it long? Well, by the time y'all watching this, I probably already decided, but the shoes are on, the bag, but I feel like I like it. I like it short. All right, y'all, so I'm about to get ready to head out, but first, because I didn't do this, and it was a put on my freaking perfume, so. I need to spray my perfume all over me. And then, I'm heading out. Now we good to go. Look you guys, I get in the car, look what your girl got, roses. And baby, these ain't even regular roses, these are white roses. Usually it be red roses, but white roses, you know, it's giving L-O-R-V-A-E. <laughs> <laughs> but they so pretty. Look at him. Look at the rosies. Isn't they cute? They smell good. And they match my outfit. Makeup still looking good, baby. Spin it out. It's been about three, four hours since I did my makeup. Y'all see the fits? Y'all see the makeup? Y'all, we got lobster bites. I wonder if this is just like full lobster, but they look so fine and the bread is soft. And wine. Cheers. Food is served. All right, y'all, so I've made it back home. And again, I want to give a big thanks to Estee Lauder for sponsoring this video. And as y'all can see, y'all, look at my makeup. It still looks amazing. It ain't oily. It's still matte, which I love. 
And y'all, it's seven o'clock, but I keep forgetting that daylight savings is a thing. <laughs> so it's still light outside, but it's seven o'clock. So you would think it would be dark by now, but it's not. But I'm about to go and get ice cream. We actually was supposed to do, what is it, a Ferris wheel, something like that. But I think it was booked up or closed. So we get ice cream because your girl loves desserts and I love food and I love sweets. So we're gonna go get ice cream and that's gonna be it, y'all. I'm gonna close out this video after that. <laughs> After that, but that's it. Obviously, I changed outfits because this is way more comfortable. I got this when I was in LA. I had a package delivered, so let me open it up for y'all while we're here. And I already know what it is. I got me a little decor for my coffee table. And it's just this little head. So I'm just gonna sit it on my coffee table and then put it like on top of a book or something like that. But this is what it is, y'all. And it just sits up like that. Also, I got one other thing. Wait, wait. I got another package, which this is for my vacation, which I can't wait. Because the looks for vacation, baby, y'all. This girl be kidding and looks for vacation. This is about to be a look. Look at this skirt. Tell me this ain't cute. I feel like, dang, it's stretchy. I feel like I should have got, what size did I get? Wait a minute, y'all. Cause I might be sitting this big. I got a medium. This is looking too big. I feel like I need a small. Or I'm going to have to just get it altered. But maybe vacation look is loading. So prepare yourself. Y'all, look at this. It's a freaking donut with ice cream and cereal. Captain Crunch to be exact. Ooh, it looks so good. Alrighty, y'all. I hope you all enjoyed this video. And... Also, again, thanks to Estee Lauder for sponsoring this video. Now, don't forget to shop now, you guys. To find your perfect shade, don't forget to do Estee Lauder's virtual trial tool at estelauder.com. So, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next vloggy vlog. See you in the next vloggy vlog. Love you all. Bye.